Hello my friends this your YouTube channel AB Medicos. In this video we are going to talk about Bartholin cyst. Bartholin cysts, also known as Bartholin's duct cysts, are common gynecological conditions that affect women of all ages. These cysts develop in the Bartholin's glands, which are located on each side of the vaginal opening. While often harmless, Bartholin cysts can cause discomfort and, in some cases, require medical attention. In this comprehensive article, we will explore the causes, symptoms, treatment options, and prevention strategies associated with Bartholin cysts. Anatomy of Bartholin's Glands Before delving into Bartholin cysts, it's essential to understand the anatomy of the Bartholin's glands. These glands are responsible for producing a small amount of fluid that helps lubricate the vaginal area. They are situated on either side of the vaginal opening and play a crucial role in sexual health. Causes of Bartholin cysts Bartholin cysts develop when the ducts that carry the gland's fluid to the vaginal opening become blocked or obstructed. Several factors can contribute to this blockage, including infection, bacterial infections, such as those caused by Escherichia coli e, coli or sexually transmitted infections STIs like gonorrhea or chlamydia, can lead to inflammation and blockage of the ducts. Trauma Injury to the Bartholin's glands or surrounding tissues can cause the ducts to become blocked, leading to cyst formation. Hormonal changes. Fluctuations in hormonal levels, such as those that occur during the menstrual cycle or pregnancy, can affect the Bartholin's glands and increase the risk of cyst development. Symptoms of Bartholin cysts. Bartholin cysts may not always cause noticeable symptoms, especially when they are small. However, as they grow or become infected, the following symptoms may occur. Pain or discomfort in the vaginal area. Swelling on one side of the vaginal opening. Redness and tenderness around the cyst. Painful intercourse dyspareunia. Difficulty walking or sitting comfortably. Fever and flu-like symptoms if the cyst becomes infected, known as Bartholin abscess. Diagnosis. Diagnosing a Bartholin cyst typically involves a physical examination by a healthcare provider. In some cases, a swab or culture may be taken from the cyst to check for infection or rule out STIs. Imaging tests, such as ultrasound or MRI, may also be used to determine the size and location of the cyst. Treatment options. The treatment approach for Bartholin cysts depends on several factors, including the size of the cyst, whether it is infected, and the presence of symptoms. Common treatment options include warm compresses, applying warm, Moist compresses to the cyst several times a day can help reduce pain and promote drainage. Drainage. If the cyst is infected and causing severe symptoms, a healthcare provider may drain it in a procedure called incision and drainage. This involves making a small incision in the cyst to release the trapped fluid. Antibiotics. If an infection is present, a course of antibiotics may be prescribed to clear the infection. Word catheter. In some cases, a healthcare provider may insert a small catheter into the cyst after drainage to keep it open and allow for continuous drainage. Marsupialization. This surgical procedure involves creating a permanent opening in the cyst to prevent future blockages. Excision. If the cyst is recurrent or causing significant problems, surgical removal of the entire Bartholin gland may be necessary. Prevention strategies. While Bartholin cysts may not always be preventable, there are some steps individuals can take to reduce their risk. Practice safe sex. Using condoms can reduce the risk of STIs, which can lead to cyst. Formation. Good hygiene. Maintaining proper genital hygiene can help prevent bacterial infections that may contribute to cyst development. Stay hydrated. Drinking plenty of water can help prevent dehydration, which can thicken vaginal secretions and increase the risk of duct blockage. Avoid harsh soaps and products. Using gentle, fragrance-free soaps and avoiding douching can help maintain a healthy vaginal environment. Conclusion. Bartholin cysts are common and often benign, but they can cause discomfort and inconvenience. Understanding the causes, symptoms, treatment options, and prevention strategies associated with Bartholin cysts is essential for women's reproductive health. If you suspect you have a Bartholin cyst or are experiencing symptoms, consult a healthcare provider for proper diagnosis and treatment. Early intervention can help prevent complications and provide relief from the associated discomfort.